Presidential Tribunal, Tunable Tenders, Academic Records from Chicago University, Traveling Documents and Others. As Nigerians react, he has finally implicated himself. This comes as Tunubu on Tuesday opened his defense in the petition filed by the People's Demo Democratic Party, PDP, and its candidates in the 2023 presidential election, Atiku Abubakar. President Bola Tunubu on Tuesday tendered copies of his educational records from the Chicago State University before the presidential election petition court. PEPC in Abuja. This comes as Tinubu on Tuesday opened his defense in the petition filed by the People Democratic Party PDP. Chief Wale San, the lead counsel for Tinubu, also tendered a 2007 letter from the United States Embassy in Nigeria absolving Tinubu of any criminal liability in the U.S. Also tendered was a letter of request from the Nigerian Police Force, NPF, to the U.S. Embassy. Among others, Wally tendered copies of documents relating to immigration and visa records of trips that Tinubu made to the U.S. between 2011 and 2021, the Nation reports. The P E P C sitting in Abuja, Nigerian's capital, in June, admitted in evidence a, trans a transcript in an aid of admission into Chicago State University made by Southwest College in the name of Tinubu, who was identified as a female. Sahara reporters had reported that Atiku and his party had tendered the document to prove the allegations against Tinubu in their joint petition, challenging Tinubu's declaration as the winner of the February 25th presidential election. Other documents tendered and admitted as exhibits by the court are a certified true copy of a certificate supposedly issued to Tinubu by the Chicago State University a certificate of service by the National Youth Service Corps, NYNC, issued in the name of Tinubu Bola Adekunle, not Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Party membership card and certificate of service from Mobi Oye, Nigeria, PLC. Other documents tendered by the petitioners in urging the court to nullify Tinubu's election our authorized judgment of the USA District Court for criminal forfeiture of assets of Tunable, as well as a printout of the Guinea passport belonging to Tunable. Also tendered were a certificate of compliance with a witness statement on oath. And Nigerians have reacted. Finally, he has implicated himself. Someone said, President Tinubu, the man with focus. God bless Nigeria, President Bola Tinubu, and good people of Nigeria. Hmm. Oh my God, this is just the beginning. The man with the main forged certificate. I want to tell you how this goes. Last, last, Tinubu is going to be Tunubu is going to be, uh, Tunubu's victory is going to be nullified by the court. Okay, guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. Though. As someone said, there is no how Tunubu will escape this judgment. He has forged the results. He never went to Chicago University. The woman that went to Chicago University is already dead. So Tunubu has more to tell. Hmm, Nigerians. If you not fear Tunubu, Naim Bise, you not go feel fear anything again. This man, because of whatsoever, he can do anything to get what he wants. Power. Hmm. Nigerians. Now, this one's nine people they talk now. Say, as Tunubu done, 
present all the certificates and traveling documents and all that showing that he has been traveling to us and all that and the chicago university certificate they said is fake understand say finally he don't implicate himself you know say atiku abubaka you know talk say dollar made to the book go school say the name when they carry that is the certificate when he carry say he graduated from chicago university say na lie say na female get one female when they call tinubu a and all that now he get that certificate say no be tinubu get up now tinubu don't go present a certificate they say is the true copy you understand the true certified copy of his certificate that he is the one that owns the certificate not any other person nigerians are now saying that Finally, he has implicated himself in this case. You know, say, there, there are um, a lot of evidences implicating Bola Metunubu in this very case. And Nigerians are really uh, hoping that with all this evidence, you know, according to what they're saying, that the court will nullify Bola Metunubu's victory, you know, as a Nigerian president. Because, because... He is not fit to be Nigerian president or that constitutions with all that that is surrounding him. Well, we are waiting, we are watching to see how the court will go about this. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you.